message. Uh, hello? Hello? Uh, see? I told you you'd do just fine. Uh, anyway, I thought I'd mention, uh, we, we have this little, um, uh, list of, uh, <coughs> problems, uh, that we have observed with the animatronics over some time. Uh, it, it's, it's nothing to be concerned about, but, but the animatronics do have a few minor glitches, uh, yeah. Uh, we're of course trying to get them fixed, uh, but you should know some of them so you don't get, uh, uh nervous if you hear anything. Let me see, um, the animatronics sometimes start to walk around on their own, uh, sometimes in the morning we find them in the strangest places, <laughs> uh, so you may see them walking around while you're here. Uh, let me see, some of their sensors are a bit wonky, uh, and, and, oh, and in case the animatronics is experiencing violence towards a guest, the animatronic will try to seek out the cause and, uh, stop it. Uh, yeah, yeah, I, I have no idea how it decides to do that, but it, it doesn't seem to mind it with the children, though. It, it's, it's weird. If, the, if there are children playing cops and robbers, you know, and one of them gets shot, you know, uh, the animatronics don't really do anything out of the ordinary. Uh, except after that day, uh, the animatronics don't really seem to function properly around adults. Uh, especially not around the staff. Uh, yeah, the animatronics seem to ignore you most of the time, you know, unless you come near them. And they just turn their heads and look at you. Like, as if you just told a bad joke. <laughs> I, I don't know, it, it, it's kind of creepy. Um, but yeah, we kind of had an accident about a month ago. It seems to have, like, traumatized their systems or something like that. Uh, anyway, we replaced the faulty animatronic with some brand new ones. Yeah, so he's stored way in the back until we can get someone to fix him. Anyway, to harm you, I keep the other ones at a distance and uh, use the doors if you have to. Um, that would be it for now. Uh, ha have a good night.